Doug and PA back with another one. This is another women in their student loan debt video, but kind of a different one here. Apparently, there was a woman on TikTok who was begging for roses to pay off her student loan debt. I guess one rose is like a cent of real money. And she got enough money to pay off her student loan debt, guys. So now there's women all over TikTok begging for money on TikTok Live to pay for their student loan debt. That's a sad state of affairs we're in right now, guys. And I'm going to say this like I say on all the rest of my women in student loan debt videos. Guys, a woman's debt should be a disqualifier for consideration for serious relationship or marriage, especially if she's begging for money on TikTok. No. So we're going to get into this compilation. The first girl, this girl is the first one to do it. She's the OG. Then I have two other women that go live every single night begging for money. We're going to get into this compilation. Before I do that, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Drop a comment. I really appreciate it. It shows you support me and what I'm doing over here. And let's get into this. Do you guys remember that girl that paid off her student debt using TikTok roses? Because that girl was me, everyone. That was me, actually. You might remember my rosometer. Okay, I got to say this. She looks like the Riddler, doesn't she? She looks like Jim Carrey as the Riddler from Batman Forever. <laughs> so bad. This paid off thirteen thousand four hundred eighty four dollars and fifty eight cents in student debt. $13,400 she got from simps, from morons, giving her money on TikTok. What is going on? $13,000. I'm in the wrong business, guys. I'm in the wrong business. Yeah, in one month. And for some reason, the movement happening right now on TikTok Live is people who, in the most nebulous sense, are referring to me with a lot of incorrect details. Also, the math is like crazy wrong for a lot of people. It is one half of a US penny that a live streamer receives for a TikTok rose. So I figured I would clear that up in the beginning, but I'm gonna go live on TikTok. I don't have a thermometer goal right now. Someday I'd like to buy a house, but- So she's gonna try to buy a house with TikTok roses now? Sounds about right, guys. Sounds about right, doesn't it? I don't have a thermometer goal. I'm just going to go live. And I know a lot of you would like to use TikTok Live to pay off your collective debts. I had mine taken care of because of your amazing support. So I'm going live. I'm going to be there, chat with all of you, and give you all advice and do the math for you. Because so many people have the math wildly off. So let me help you. Let me do the math for you. And let me give you advice on how to succeed here on TikTok Live as well. If you see that little flashing icon... I'm live, and I'm so happy to hang out with you and answer all People gave this pack of red and pink Starburst $13,000, guys. Come on. Come on. This is not making any sense to me. Is it making any sense to you? And I hope none of you guys don't donate to these women. Don't do it. All right, I have a much anticipated update on my student loan payoff journey. As a reminder, I'm trying to pay off my student loans by going live every single night until I have enough roses to pay off my student loans. Begging, just begging, that's what it is, guys. So last night I went live and I made $1,330, which is crazy. I was not expecting that and I was not expecting that video to blow. $1,330, who's giving these women money? It has to stop. Guys, don't give any of these women money. I'm probably going to say that a couple more times in this compilation, but I just can't wrap my head around this. I just can't. Up. So I'm super grateful, and I appreciate anybody who sent any TikTok gifts. Also add, I don't know how much I made from the video itself or if anything yet. I am a part of the TikTok creativity program, but it takes a few days sometimes to update on your views. And also not every video qualifies for the creativity program, which would be awful because that video has like 7.5 million views. So hopefully I do get paid for the video. But until I know for sure, I am going to keep going live. So I will be live tonight at 8 p.m. If you guys want to hang out with me, I had a lot of fun last night. I also have a little bit of an updated goal because you actually get paid a little bit less than I thought per rose. So I actually still need 1.2 million roses and also need to take into consideration taxes um but yeah anyway i will also keep you guys updated on how much i make from the video if i made anything from that video and we will see you guys tonight for begging guys all this is and there are so many women doing this
She's already made $1,300 in one night. I can't believe it. Can I pay off my student loan debt with TikTok roses by my 30th birthday, which is in just 14 days? It sounds crazy. It sounds insane. It sounds like begging. It doesn't sound doable, right? But in my crazy mind, I thought to myself, Taylor, you can do that. You can do that too, because you do have a lot of student loans. I looked at my phone and I logged into Nelnet. I said, sheesh. Don't get me wrong, graduating from college is one of the best times of my life, but it did cost me a nice little pretty penny. I used to work so many jobs. Hell, I even started a candle business to help offset that cost to create an extra source of income for myself. But you know how it is when you're trying to scale your business. It's just going to take some time. And I've You could also get into a relationship with a man. Two incomes are better than one, although I would hate for her to saddle a man with all of her debt. She looks like the, the kind of woman that has over $100,000 in student loan debt. I've accepted that. Fast forward to six months ago, I had this grand plan that I was going to be debt-free by 30, and I was going to do it all through paid gigs and UGC content. But that fell through. So here we are. She said paid gigs and UGC content. So she's some kind of creative, maybe? Is she a singer? Who knows? But here's the thing. My birthday is in exactly 14 days in which I turn 30 and I'm still trying to hit that goal to be debt free. So we're going to give this a try. This challenge sounds so insane, but honestly, the more insane, the crazier sign me up. Just to preface, I did not come up with this challenge by myself. I got the idea from Princess Etch. She did this herself about maybe a year or two ago and she was able to pay off her student loans by going live on TikTok and getting roses. I believe that the TikTok roses only equate to half of a penny. So 0 0.005 cents. On the lives, I'll be doing special incentives, a little giveaways here and there. So you might want to tune in. Now, if my math is mathing correctly, I'm going to need about 8 million roses. You never know. God works in mysterious ways. So we just go over to try. Just make sure that you're tuned in and you follow along on the journey because it's only crazy until it happens. Begging, guys. This is all this is. And I refuse to donate. I'm not... Uh, I'm only on TikTok to get content from my channel. Guys, don't give these women money. In fact, don't spend any time on TikTok that you don't have to. That's a good general rule. If you're a man, you, especially if you're under 35, you shouldn't have time to be on TikTok watching TikTok lives and giving these women money. Let me know what you think about this in the comments. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you on the next one.